Today we're going to take a look at the mystery that is Wake on LAN by UDM in ET4L schools. First thing we need to find out is what Wake on LAN is all about. What is it? Uh, it's an industry standard protocol and it's a way that you can wake computers up from a very low power state and do it remotely. So you don't have to be at the computer providing it's in a specific condition you uh, can wake that device up and get it to perform some function or a task that's been sent to it. Which devices can you wake up? Uh, well the main things that you need to be aware of are that it's the Windows desktop PCs. So any physical desktop PC that you have in your school that's been F12 built and that was purchased of the contract so we're talking about Lenovo or HP desktops uh, you should be able to have them in the right conditions wake on LAN. The Windows laptops, Windows tablets, Windows notebooks and even Apple Macs cannot be woken via UDM so not even worth trying just uh, stick to the desktops. So what are these right conditions that we're talking about? Well, the desktop PC, the desktop Windows PC, has to be plugged into the PowerPoint. It, that PowerPoint has to be turned on. The device itself has to be in a shutdown state. So not sleeping, not hibernating, not on screen saver. It has to be actually shut down for the wake on LAN task to perform its function. Then it has to be plugged into the network using a working network cable and preferably it's plugging straight into the wall which is connected to your um, distribution cabinet which has a HP managed switch inside it uh, so that's a DOE standard device any non-standard switches like uh, little D-Link or Netgear switches that you might have under tables in classrooms are probably not going to pass through the wake on LAN protocol signal so that will stop the function working right there so how do you set Wake on LAN in UDM? You basically go into uh, a room in UDM. All your devices that are in that room that have been F12 built will show up. You can tick any or all of them and you can click the continue button and you'll see a screen like what you see here and you can choose the option to Wake on LAN. Other options you can do with UDM are re-image the device using uh, a particular flavor of Windows and uh, then you can click the confirm button. You can also uh, set an option to schedule the task. So you can say you want it to happen at 2 p.m. or 3 p.m. after school on a particular date. And providing uh, that device has actually woken up within 20 minutes of the time that you set, it will work. If it hasn't woken up after 20 minutes or so, it probably won't work. And it's pro possibly due to one of the conditions not being met that we discussed earlier. This um, particular uh, discussion that we've gone through is all captured in an infographic that you can download using the link in the, um, in the information description of this video below. So feel free to download and print that for yourself. This has been a presentation of T4L TV and we hope to bring you some more in the near future.